So Rick, he wants to have a life with you. He he wants to work out your marriage, but he's not he's not touching you. Nope. Has he attempted to touch you? I'm gonna say. That. No. He's always too tired and overworked. Yeah, you know that works maybe for a day, maybe two days, but you, you guys are back together for a while and. Too bad you weren't there for my performance. For your dad? He's falling for every word. Are you sure? Because why didn't he just sign the papers then? Because he's a smart man and he wants to read the fine print. But don't worry, he'll sign. And as soon as he does, I'll have irrevocable control as CEO. If you sign these papers, you give Rick all the power. For one year only. Is that what you want? Look, I'm about to go on a trip with my brother. What I want is to be able to go on that trip and enjoy myself without worrying about this company. I get that, but this is some scary stuff. Taking away all the checks and balances, putting one person in complete control? I understand the significance, yes. So what are you gonna do? Are you signing these papers? Not midnight yet, but I like this plan. Start celebrating early. Yes, very good. Thank you. And besides, isn't it like like January 3rd or 4th or something in Australia? I don't know. Yeah, because uh, we're definitely three days ahead. The that point, makes sense. the point is <laughs> New Year's Eve has come and gone. Yeah, well, you know what? I think I have some friends who would still be found in a club. Oh, uh, oh, well, I mean, we could do that if you want. Do what? I don't know. Go to a club? Is that Ooh. something you like to do on New Year's? I... No. <sighs> you know what? I am exactly where I want to be. Oh, bless your heart. Now, why would I want to go to a club and not be able to hear a single word you're saying. <laughs> Pay way too much money for watered down drinks when I could be right here snuggling you. Oh, good. Because I would so much rather spend New Year's Eve with one beautiful woman than five billion strangers. Huh. I have a feeling you're talking about little old me. Look, I know you're looking forward to your trip coming up, and yes, it would be nice to not think about work while you're gone, but you can still do that without giving Rick irrevocable control. Carter, it's a vote of confidence. Something Rick needs from me. Something he hasn't felt he's always had. Well, it sounds like he hasn't always deserved it. Spoken like a true friend of Rich. He's given you an earful, hasn't he? Well, you're smart enough to know there's, a, there's another side to every story. Look, signing this is a way for me to pass the baton off to, to Rick and to Caroline. And it's something I've been wanting to do. I just didn't think it would happen this soon. Is this the way to do it? I want to show Rick that I value him and that I, I trust him. You know, I think you're right. I think your dad is gonna sign those papers. I just hope he doesn't take weeks and weeks. I don't think he will. He's about to take a trip to Europe. I think he'd like to get it done before then. A trip to Europe? Yeah. Like a quick trip, or? I think he's gonna be there for a while. Which got me thinking, a great big empty house. Well, it's not empty. Ivy and Allie still live there. We can always shoot them to one of the guest houses if they get in our way. And of course, Caroline's not gonna be taking up any space. Wait, it, if they get in our way, what are you? I'm saying, pack your bags. We're moving on up. <laughs> May I 
I think it's pretty easy to understand. You know, can't forget my involvement with you. And he wants to. He's he's trying, but that's why he's keeping his distance. Yeah, no, maybe that's it, or or, or maybe that's something else. What do you mean? I don't know what I mean. It just it doesn't make a lot of sense to me. He's all affectionate and loving when he's here, and you get home, and he he won't touch you. It doesn't make sense to me. That's all. I don't know. Maybe, maybe tonight will be different. Why? Because well, it's New Year's Eve. What better time to reconnect than a night where you lay the past to rest and you resolve to be better in the year ahead. I'm committed to being better. I'm committed to my marriage. I'm going to take this back to the office, read it over again, and make sure you and the company are protected. Is that really necessary? I mean, this is Rick. This is my son. There's no reason to think there's anything underhanded going on here. No, of course not, but let me earn my paycheck. Okay, okay. <laughs> Actually, that's good. Give me a chance to think about what I'm going to do. <laughs> just a test. Just a test. I'm just making sure everything's in working order. Full midnight. If we if we have an intruder. <laughs> Ooh. <All right. laughs> uh, I got a happy New Year's text from Caroline with with firework emojis. How does she? Where does she find this stuff? Hey, um, you haven't you haven't said anything to her about Rick and Maya, have you? Uh, no, I didn't really think it was my place. Okay. Good, because I was just thinking I'm the one who saw them kissing, so I should be the one who says something. Have you mentioned it to anybody else? No. Rick made it pretty clear when he was pressuring me to keep my mouth shut that it was just a goodbye kiss. Look, I don't know what he's up to, but I don't like it. I don't know how much longer I can keep this to myself. Moving. But I just got here. And this place rocks. But once we come out of hiding as a couple, you're gonna love it up there. Tennis court? I don't play tennis. Well, then I'll teach you. Swimming pool? I mean, you do... <gasps> yes, I do know how to swim. Yeah? The view. It's not a bad idea, is it? <sighs> Moving into your father's mansion. For real? Yeah, well, if I'm gonna be CEO, I shouldn't be shoved into the guest house. We're gonna take over the main house, front <laughs> and center. Oh, I can't wait. <laughs> Well, we are going to have to wait, you know, maybe one more day or so. I wish you could stay. Can't you? You know I can't. All right. Caroline can have you for tonight, but only because I am going to have you for the rest of my life. You be careful when you get home. What do you mean? Well, it's New Year's Eve. Your wife's gonna wanna celebrate. I can handle Caroline. Better, because I don't want her anywhere near my CEO. Mm. Happy New Year, my love. I will be thinking of you when the clock strikes midnight. again. Hi. Hi. Is Rick here? Uh, no, he's he's not. Now come in? Sure, yes, of course, please. <laughs> so, what's going on? Your husband wants me to do something. Hey, Rich. 
You're here. Um, what, what are you doing? I'm working. It's New Year's Eve. That's what I heard. So why are you here? You should be out. Yeah, no, I, I will be. I'm a party. I just have to go over these documents for your dad first. What documents? Rick had these drawn up. He might want to take a look. I may need to cut you off. All this talk about Rick and Maya. I'm not slurring. <laughs> no, no, I'm just trying to prevent a drunken phone call to Caroline at the end of the night. Ah, uh, <laughs> yeah, I'll be doing my best to avoid that. Uh, maybe I'll tell her. I don't know. Definitely not tonight. That's good. Mm -hmm. That's good. Do you know why? Because mm -hmm. we have other things to think about. One man believing in me to change everything. You believed in me that I could run this company, live in this big house. Those eyes, that smile. Finally, a woman who is honest and loyal and committed to me. Imagine my life without you. You won't ever have to. Rick would have absolute power for a year. The way things are now, I can replace them anytime I think it's necessary. Uh, but if I sign this, I would lose that ability. Was well, there any reason that you would want to replace him? No. Rick tells me he needs this. He says the two of you are a wonderful couple, and that you're terrific together, and that you're ready to take over. And the fact is, I agree. Are you? Is everything good between you? Hey, hey. Sorry I'm late. Hey, I was just about to call you. Glad I picked up a bottle of the good stuff. It's almost midnight. Yeah. Dad, you want to join us? No, no, I'll let you two celebrate. I was just telling Caroline about your proposal. Yeah. And to answer your question, yes, things are good. And I think Rick will make an excellent CEO. And I think you should have complete faith in him and that he will run the company exactly as you'd want. I believe in him 100%. Irrevocable power as CEO, huh? Rick claims that he's proven himself, not just at work, but with Caroline, too. And this is a chance for your father to show his support, but let's face it, Rick considers you a threat. If Eric signs that, then he doesn't have to worry about you undermining his authority. What are you up to, Ricky boy? What are you up to? Fancy hat. Hat me. hat me. Your fancy wizard hat. Oh, yeah. There we go. Presto. Or right, grab some, some noisemakers. Hey, why? Is it, is it, what's the time? I think. Oh, the year is almost over. Thank God. Can you... What? Can you please stop complaining about one of the best years of my life? Really? 
guess. I mean, I moved to Los Angeles. I got my own jewelry line at Forrester <laughs> Creations. I, uh, I, I fell in love and I went to Paris with you and Amsterdam. <sighs> this has been an epic year. Well, if you think that's epic, where do you see what I have in store for you for next year? <laughs> um, it's really? midnight. It's midnight. This is it. Ooh, happy New Year! Happy New Year! <laughs> So my dad is really considering signing this. Seems to be, especially now that Rick and Caroline are happy again. Are they happy, are they? Oh, they're reunited. You know how Eric thinks. He wants the power couple leading Forrester forward. Well, I don't think he's seen the whole picture here. Rick, he's got issues I can't even tell you about. But this is a calculated move. I don't know what he wants, but something isn't right. Hey. You should have been here. The view of the fireworks was great for my apartment. Wait till you see them from my dad's backyard next year. It's even a better view. Next year? Yeah, we'll count on it. I hate how we have to pretend. Tonight's gonna be the last night that we'll be apart. I feel it. My dad's gonna sign those papers tomorrow and we can come out as a couple. I hope you're right. I am. Where's Caroline? She's in the shower. And she probably thinks the night's just beginning. Don't give in to her. I won't. One more night. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. <laughs>